Hello everyone. Welcome to this series on literary terms and literary theory. If you want to study the notes and MCQs related to this term, you can click the link given in the description. We are also going to start our online and offline classes for UGC NET for English literature very soon. So stay connected with us. In this video, we will discuss the term doggerel. Introduction. Doggerel is a term used to describe a specific type of versification characterized by its rough, heavy-footed and jerky nature. It often exhibits monotonous regularity in meter and features tritely conventional sentiments. While doggerel is typically seen as the result of inaptitude on the part of the poet, some skilled writers deliberately employ it for satiric, comic, or rollicking effects. This video explores the concept of doggerel in poetry, its historical origins, and its deliberate use by poets for various artistic purposes. Historical Origins of Doggerel The term doggerel finds its roots in Middle English, where doggerel meant trivial or low-quality verse. Over time, it evolved to describe unpolished and awkwardly constructed poetry. One early example of intentional doggerel is found in the works of John Skelton, a 15th century poet known for his use of skeltonics. Skeltonics are short lines with two or three stresses, intentionally rough and variable in meter, as exemplified in his poem Colin Clout. Skelton employed this form to create a distinct and lively style that emphasized satire and humor. Deliberate use of doggerel for satiric effect One notable example of the deliberate use of doggerel for satiric effect is Samuel Butler's poem Hudibras. Written in the 17th century, Hudibras is known for its comically grotesque octosyllabic couplets with irregular rhymes. Butler employed this form, known as hudibrastic verse, to satirize the prevailing political and religious beliefs of his time. Through the use of broken and tumbled lines, Butler's poem effectively mocked the hypocrisy and absurdity of the characters he portrayed. The Role of Doggerel in Comic Poetry Doggerel also plays a crucial role in comic poetry. Poets often use this form to create light-hearted and humorous verses that entertain the readers. By intentionally breaking the conventions of formal poetry, comic poets can infuse their work with a playful spirit and a sense of fun. In doing so, they engage readers in a light-hearted exploration of various themes making doggerel an effective tool for comedic expression. Critique and Reception of Doggerel Despite its intentional use for satire and humor, doggerel has received criticism from literary purists who view it as a degradation of poetic artistry. Detractors argue that doggerel lacks the refinement and elegance associated with traditional poetic forms. However, defenders of the style contend that doggerel serves a valuable purpose in the literary landscape by offering a refreshing departure from more serious and formal poetry. Conclusion In conclusion, doggerel is a form of rough and irregular versification that may result from the poet's lack of skill or deliberately employed for satiric, comic, or rollicking effects. John Skelton's Skeltonics and Samuel Butler's Hudibrastic verse are examples of intentional use of doggerel for artistic purposes. Despite criticism from some quarters, doggerel continues to be a dynamic and engaging form of poetic expression that adds diversity and humor to the world of poetry. So, this was the discussion on the term doggerel. If you have any doubts or questions, you can ask in the comments section. We will meet in the next video with some other term.
Until then, goodbye and thank you.